news this morning. Now here's Charlotte with more on government plans to get police and fire departments working together. And the idea is that emergency services will be bundled together in new plans to help protect the public and save money. The government will announce measures today that will allow fire chiefs to command police services, despite not having crime-fighting experience. Jonathan Swain's in South London for us this morning. So, Jonathan, this is all about encouraging collaboration between the departments, but there will be those that are saying it's just to save money. Well, Charlotte, that's right, because they're used to alarm bells, aren't they, ringing in a place like this. And today, these proposals may, may well uh, set them off, because at the minute, our emergency services are run as separate businesses, if you like. They all have their uh, different buildings. Of course, they need their different vehicles, such as fire engines. But do they really need uh, different teams of backroom staff? Because one of these proposals is to have a central control room that handles all 999 calls. And there are other proposals, particularly for the fire service as well. There's a burning issue to change the way our services respond to emergencies. Of course, firefighters will still be the ones to put out the blaze, but it could be a police chief in charge. The fire service will be the easy target for cuts. We're already seeing uh, cuts to stations and to, to fire pumps all over the country, and I believe this move could make that a whole lot worse. So in future, the fire service could be run by a police and crime commissioner. It's a collaboration the government hopes will serve communities better, improve the way the public is protected and save taxpayers money. Those on the front line, though, think it could be a costly mistake. It really is a very different thing that the police do from us. When it comes to PCCs, you shouldn't have jacks and jills of all trades. The recent floods shows just how the emergency services already work well together, and these changes behind the scenes may have little effect on cooperation like that. Jonathan Swain, Good Morning.